Hari Om. We'll start with uh, one Om chant. Oh. My gratitude to Vivek Ji and also Seeker to Facilitator Coordinators for this reflection opportunity. Last week, many of us were fortunate in Cleveland who attended uh, Swami Prakashananda Ji's Gyan Yajna on Ramayana Kishkinda Kant. We all felt bhakti around us. When we say bhakti, we also think about bhakta and bhagwan. When we think of bhakta, there is one name which comes to our mind who is the greatest bhakta. Use chat and tell me who is the greatest bhakta. Yeah, Hanumanji. When we are talking about Hanumanji, how can we not talk about Sri Ramji? We all have chanted Vishnu Sastranama for so many mornings. So let's start this Bhakti Bhava with chanting one of the verses from Vishnu Sastranama. We all know this, we can all chant. Vanamali Gadi Shanki Shanki Chakri Chanandaki Sriman Narayan or Vishnu Vasu Devo Virakshatu Vanamali Gadi Shanki Shanki Chakri Chanandaki Shriman Narayan or Vishnu Vasudevo Virakshatu Vanamali Gadi Shanki Shanki Chakri Chanandaki Shriman Narayan or Vishnu Vasudevo Virakshatu Vasudeva Virakshatu Om Namaiti Bhagavad Gita is Bhagwan's song to express the truth of Mahavakya Tat Tvam Asi. So far, we have reflected upon chapters 1 to 6 which talks about Tvam, which is me, which is Arjuna, which is all of us, which is all Jivas, which is Purusha. Hence, we talk about self-effort, Purushartha, or Karma Yoga. The second section, which is from chapter 7 to chapter 12 is talking about or feeling about him, Sri Krishna, Tat. In this section, we feel about him, we feel about his grace his effort. The first section is all about self-effort. The second section is all about his effort. And the third section deals with or talks about asi, which is nothing but the integration of tat and tvam, which is tattva Chapter 7 
is the beginning of the second section where we will feel about him we will talk about shri krishna we will talk about that for him to be felt there is a great example in verse 7 and two words from verse 7 are sutre manigana we have heard this example many many times remember the thread which is bhagwan which is unseen connects all the pearls together to make a necklace we are all pearls we are all connected with bhagwan together Vivekji also talked about that, yeah, we are all pearls, we are all bhakta. Then what makes us different? It is the intensity of everyone's bhakti that makes bhakta special. Vivekji also talked about that we always use pearls as an example in this when we talk about sutra manigana i will leave you all with one reflection discussion item is why we don't talk about diamonds in this example you can go back to verse 7 it's explained there you can look at atma bodha and you can get this answer there and i know you know it but go back if you need and reflect upon. Chapter 7 is also called an introduction to Jnana and Vijnana Yoga. To know him, we need Guru. Guru will give us the Jnana about Shastra. That is Jnana, that is knowledge. But to feel him, we need Vigyan, which is intuition. We need deep reflection. To know something, we need to know about that and we need to have a knowledge about that. Like if we want to become a doctor, we need to know about the medical science subjects. Similarly, if we want to become an engineer, we need to know about the engineering subjects. Similarly, if we want to know about Shastra, if we want to become Bhakta, we need to know about it. We need Guru to give us Jnana. We can think about Hanumanji again. Hanumanji is called Jnana Gunasagar. He doesn't have just the knowledge. He has so much knowledge. That is Vikyan. We all have chanted and heard Tvameva Mata Chapita Tvameva Tvameva Bandhus Chasakha Tvameva Tvameva Vidya Dravidam Tvameva Tvameva Sarvam Mama Deva Deva, right? But how many of us feel that? <clears throat> we all have been asked to um, register for happiness series that's happening from December 4th to December 6th, right? How many of us have registered for that? If you will ask, some of us will join. Some of us may have some, you know, reasons not to join, which we can call excuse as well. If we say, Tvameva Sarvam Mama Deva Deva, am I feeling that I need to go to that happiness series to learn about him? to know more about myself, to feel that I am joy, reflect upon. If you need to drive the car, you need to know the driving. Yes. And now the driving is our second nature. But is this the second nature for a high schooler who is 16 year old? He need to 
get the uh, theoretical knowledge. He needs to get the practical knowledge. He needs to clear the test to get the license and then practice to get good and good and good. And then it becomes the second nature. I use journal to keep practicing, keep reading what you know I hear in the satsang and then reflect on that to feel him in my center and feel joy. I will end this reflection by again going back to Vishnu Sastranama to continue the feel of bhakti. And we will chant one of the verses from there as well. Shri Ram Ram Rame De Rame Rame Mano Rame Sahasranam Tatulyam Ram Nam Varanani Shri Ram Ram Rame De Rame Rame Mano Rame Sahasranam Tatulyam Ram Nam Varanani Shri Ram Ram Rame De Rame Rame Mano Rame Sahasranam Tatulyam Ram Nam Varanani Shri Ram Nam Varanana Om Namaiti Hari Om. Remember, Ram and Krishna are just two forms. They are nothing but same. Hari Om. Take care.